Well, it's been over a month since the new distracted driving law went into effect here in Ohio. And a state highway patrol is still seeing people with phones while driving. So news reporter Riley Phillips got to see it firsthand just how this law works and what people need to know. This new distracted driving law means you got to put your phone down when you get behind the wheel. But what exactly can and can't you do and what do law enforcement officers look for? I'm riding along with OSP to find out. Come on. Caught red handed. One of several people we saw on their phones while driving Friday afternoon. This woman got a warning, but troopers say that doesn't take away from the danger she put herself in and others while on the road. People think that they can they can text and drive, and unfortunately, it's resulted in the people's lives. It's not just a fine or a fee. Ohio State Highway Patrol is trying to get the word out about the new distracted driving law. The law has been in effect for over a month now, but they're still seeing people texting on social media, even watching videos while driving. And while you think you may be slick enough to get away with it, Sergeant Tyler Ross says troopers can always tell when you're on your phone. We get a lot of people call in to our pound 677 impaired driver line and they'll say I'm you know behind an impaired motorist or what I think to be a reckless operator. We'd stop them and most of the time they're texting because they have those same indicators they're weaving or they're having trouble staying in their lane of travel. So those are things that we look for when we're behind vehicles. You see them weave, you see them leave their lane of travel. So what can't you do under this new law? You can't text or dial a phone number. Browsing the internet or scrolling through social media is also off limits. No watching videos, playing games, or FaceTiming a friend. You also can't use any part of your body to hold your phone, even if you're talking on speakerphone. If it's on your any part of your body, it's just it's a it's a potential and an opportunity for a distraction. So Unless it's all the way up to your ear, that's the only time any part of your body can be touching it. You can hold your phone up to your ear to talk, but using Bluetooth and hands-free devices are best. You can also make phone calls for emergencies, and you can use your phone at traffic lights. But what happens if you're caught using your phone while driving? Your first offense is two points on your license and up to a $150 fine. Second offense is three points on your license and up to a $250 fine. And a third offense is four points on your license and a $500 fine. Since 2018, there have been more than 63,000 crashes involving distracted driving and 1,800 of those were fatal or caused serious injuries. Sergeant Ross hopes this new law will help people realize just how dangerous being on your phone while driving really is. It's just another tool in our tool belt that's going to allow us to to make our roadway safer. Our goal is the same that it always has been and always will continue to be and that's save lives. So that's our goal. And the trooper may have issued a warning today, but it won't be a warning come October. In Lebanon, Riley Phillips, 2 News.